Hey guys, on today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to transfer music from your Mac to your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch, okay? So, first of all, I'm gonna teach you how to transfer music to your iTunes. So, iTunes is what you're gonna use, okay? iTunes is free, it comes with your Mac, it's also available for PC. So, whether you have Mac or PC, it's the same thing, actually. And um, here's a folder, so I have a ton of music here. Okay, so we're right here, right? So, let's just drag something on top of here. And then that would sync up. At this point, that music's already in there, so that's why it didn't transfer over. But that's how you would do it, just drag and drop on top of here. You can also drag and drop right here, and it's technically the same thing, but usually we've always done it right here on the side. Anyways, once you've done that, make sure to plug in your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch to your computer, and then you guys should see this icon up here, which is your iPhone, maybe your iPad, or iPod Touch. So just click right there that top left hand corner and you guys will see this so here's my iphone so let's just go right into music and here we can see that we want to sync up our entire music library so just make sure that's checked on or you guys can select whatever music you guys want so that's your second option at this point we're just going to do the entire library and we're just going to press sync down here below you guys will see sync so let's just press sync so, something to note is that your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch can only sync up to one iTunes on one computer, okay? So, that means that if you already synced it up to another computer, which has another iTunes account, that will be different, okay? And um, if you do that, so if you have it synced up to another account, another computer, another iTunes, um, and you try to sync it up to this one, then all that music from that account will get erased and this will replace that. So that's why it's always good to just sync it up to one iTunes account and that way you guys will always keep your music. Um, if you guys have that problem where, I don't know, maybe you guys got rid of that computer or something, right? So just make sure to have that music that you had from before in your other iTunes on a folder like this and then you guys can just drag and drop it into this new iTunes, new computer and that way you guys will not lose any of the music really. It's gonna give you that warning that it will erase whatever um, and it's gonna replace with this iTunes music but technically if you guys already dragged in your music from your other computer here then it's okay. You're gonna have the same mu music obviously, right? Anyways, um, once it's done, then that's it. All you guys have to press is done, and that's all. Uh, by the way, here in iTunes, you guys can make your backup for your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch, so you guys don't need iCloud, for example. So if you're running out of space constantly with your iCloud, you guys can make your backup right here on your computer, and that way you keep it safe. And the gigs, you know how iCloud has five gigs? Here on iTunes, you have pretty much unlimited gigs. You have as many gigs as you have on your computer to back up, okay? And um, as long as you have more gigs on your of space on your Mac or your whatever laptop you're using, um, then your iPhone, then you're always gonna have that space to back it up if you guys want to. But um, anyways, this video was about just syncing up your new music to your iPhone, transferring all that. As you guys can see, this is the way to do it. It's gonna take some time since it's, you know, a thousand songs. So it's gonna take quite a bit. Um, it should not take, for a thousand songs, for example, it will not take more than 15 minutes. If you guys are there more than 15 minutes, something might be wrong. Then again, your computer or your iPhone could be a little bit slow and that's why it's taking that long. Um, on average, you guys sh shouldn't see that this would be a whole day thing, right? And as long as you guys are seeing this up here, says syncing music to your iPhone and then saying copying whatever music to your iPhone. If that keeps going and going, then nothing's stuck, then you're good to go. Make sure your iPhone's up to date so iTunes gets working properly. And uh, that's about it. Anyways, if you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.